Ah, welcome back, my friends, to Jesse's Storytime Spectacular. And in this beautiful, awesome series that I've got going on, The Blair Witch. Everything you didn't know about The Blair Witch. This will be episode two, my friends. Strap yourselves in, because we've got a good one. Obviously, uh, if most of you have seen these films, you know, I'm talking Blair Witch, The Blair Witch Project, Blair Witch 2, Book of Shadows, and Blair Witch 2016, okay? Going right off that. Y'all have heard the whole thing about, like, alright, who is the Blair Witch, right? So they subtly mention her every once in a while, but... You guys might not have picked it up, but, you know, all right. It's this chick, Ellie Kedward. And I'm, I hope I'm saying that right, but I think I am, yeah. Anyway, apparently, she had quite a troubled childhood. She uh, was put into foster care and all this stuff and apparently dreamt about having her own and fantasies and stuff like that and her fantasies included having an army of stick men to, that love her and protect her and they're evil but they love her and she has very dark thoughts and uh, she's been bullied, and, uh, she's terribly, terribly, you know, beyond bullied. Let's just put it that way. For YouTube stakes, you know. But anyway, she describes herself to be, you know, having these terrible incidents as a kid and whatnot but then we get to what we really need to talk about for ellie all right so ellie kedward february 17 85 all right so a bunch of children from blair which is just the town of blair right we are not burkittsville yet we are just blair Okay. All right. So several children accuse her of like luring them to, you know, draw blood from them. And then when they actually do, I don't know, find her guilty, she does go like, she gets, you know, the court system was weird back then. So it, it ain't like it is today. Uh, you, you don't really have a lot of rights, but, uh, she was convicted and convinced of, you know, uh, convicted of witchcraft. They, you know, they were like, oh my God, it, it, it's you. It's all you. All right. So they put her through a long, long trial and like brutal, brutal torture. So they drag her body up to these black hills, find somewhere terrible so that they can, you know, put her all away. They want to, you know, they never want her to come back, so they're going to tie her to a tree. And then they want to leave her there. And let everything just kill her. Kill her, however, whatever. But they just, no mind, no bother. Right? So they just tie her to a tree. And they're like, whatever. So at the moment, all we know is she's tied to the tree and she's left for dead. Alright? Poor Ellie, of course, playing the victim, you know what I'm saying? She actually is still alive after a couple weeks somehow. 
some kids are like, you know, whoa, we kind of got to like return back to see like, is she alive? You know, but of course it's just children. So of course they're terrible and you know, just how awful children are anyway, they decide uh, they're going to laugh at her. And, of course, you know, um, you know, stab her, uh, write their names and blood and stuff into her, and, like, you know, have dogs eat part of her and attack her and all these horrible things. Horrible, horrible things. But they constantly would do it and they would have fun with it and they thought that that was cool. For whatever reason, these children are terrible, terrible, terrible. But, they did it anyway. And they beat her with, like, sticks and, you know, threw stones into her and, you know. So then they, not only is she taking this all from being tied to a tree, helpless, then they end up deciding, okay, well... We've beaten you enough, I guess. So they hang her from the same exact tree that she was tied to for three weeks or whatever. I don't know. It could have been longer. I, I could have been reading that wrong. There's also a couple different variations of that. So I've also gone way down this rabbit hole for y'all. All right. But this is the Blair Witch. Okay. And even in... The Blair Witch Project, as well as Blair Witch 2016, and probably, I think, in Book of Shadows as well. Uh, they mention her, and it's very subtle, and they just say, like, you know, they just say that, you know, she was the reason, or whatever, right? But, I'm gonna back up for a minute, so we got... Finally, Ellie's left for dead and hung and left to be, you know, to just dead and beaten and horrible, whatever, right? They go back to town, everything's supposed to be the same, you know, I guess things calm down or whatever. But... By midwinter, all of Edward, all of them, all of the accusers, as well as just half of the town's children, have all just vanished. It's not like it happened all at the same time, but they all vanish. I mean, it's just like, you know. Day after day, the more and more gone. We don't, they don't know what the heck's going on. Very unexplained. You know what I'm saying? So obviously they're like, yeah, I guess we're getting what we deserve. You know, this is the ghost of her coming back to kill us. And we will never speak her name again and ditch this town forever. So that's what they did. They... Every single resident of Blair has left. Deserted. Deserted town. Right? Completely. They were just, you know, we give up. She has cursed us and we, we don't want to die. And uh, we don't want to see anyone else die. So, we're out. Smart move. That's what I'm saying, right? That's what you should have done. Most horror movies need to learn this. It's okay, though. Alright? So, unfortunately, I've displayed a lot on there, on the screen there for you. And I gave a little history there. Right? But all throughout, you're going to find a ton 
about Allie. It's just, it's wild how this rabbit hole has gone even deeper everywhere. Like, obviously there's, if you've seen Blair Witch 2016, you can see a lot of different variations of the Blair Witch. But that's because, I mean, she has, she takes souls she loves children's souls. She's, you know, the stick figure things are, you know, her way of using portals and mess with time, and just as you would know from the films and all that. But I'll even show, you know, the little action figure toy up on here for you. And, uh, you know, some creepy stuff about it. But in the Blair Witch Project, our OG film, Heather is not lying when she says that she is Ellie. Ellie Kedward is etched in stone because they go to her real grave real grave boom there's even depictions of what she looked like from written down way history whatever you know what I'm saying but Basically, Blair, a little bit of time goes by, whatever, whatever, things, nothing's really happened, but it's just kind of like, you know, it's just like, everybody who was there is like, just way gone, so, uh, things been deserted for a while, there's a ghost town just waiting there, chilling, like, some rail miner dude ends up finding it, and then it becomes dun 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 dun, Burkittsville, Burkittsville, Maryland. Ah, ah, ah. The big setting in the town is now not Blair; it is Burkittsville, because they do not even want to mention the Blair Witch. Or any trace of Ellie Kedward. But they fear to bother her grave. And they fear her. And they don't speak her name. Ever. It's story time spectacular. I love y'all. But peace. But I need y'all to totally, 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 totally come back for episode three. Because I got a lot planned for you. I got three and four planned for you. And then we're going to keep going. All right. We're going to keep going. I want to hear all about what you guys think about Ellie Cadward. And if you think she really was the Blair Witch. Because... This is the story they go by everywhere. I mean, like, novels, internet, everything, movies. I've dug deep on this to find more about Ellie, so, uh, you know, apparently she would, you know, all of the evil things done to her, she has she haunts that now, and she wants to kill children because she was a child when a lot of the terrible things happened to her. Boom. Mind blown. I'm out. Peace. I'll see you in episode three.